Russia moved the old tanks and missiles deployed against Japan to the Ukrainian front. Multiple air defense missile systems deployed by Russia on two disputed islands off northern Japan in 2020 have been moved off the isles, an analysis of satellite images showed, raising the possibility that Moscow is repurposing weapons from its Far East for use in the war against Ukraine, according to Kyoto News Agency. It is noted that, Yukoizumi, a lecturer at the University of Tokyo, made the analysis based on satellite images of the Edorofu and Kunashiri Islands taken by U.S. space tech company Maxer Technologies Inc. Koizumi said he is also convinced that old tanks and artillery previously stored at a military facility in Sakhalin are being sent to the front lines in Ukraine. Missile units equipped with S-300 V-4 surface-to-air missile systems were stationed in Edorofu's Haidokapu Bay, known as Kasatka Bay in Russia and near Kunashiri's central settlement of Furukamapu, known as Yuznokirilsk, in Russia. Multiple transporter erector launchers carrying S-300 V-4 missiles, radars, and other equipment were visible at both military stations between mid and late September last year. Koizumi said it is possible they were redeployed to Russia's western region near its border with Ukraine in preparation for a potential attack. He also speculates that a large number of old tanks and howitzers at a military facility in southern Sakhalin were sent to Ukraine after being temporarily taken into factories for repairs. Troops from the Far East are also being dispatched to Ukraine. An elite naval infantry brigade based in Vladivostok has suffered significant losses in combat, and some residents of the Edorofu and Kunashiri Islands have died after being mobilized, according to Koizumi. The Russian military is deploying all weapons at their disposal, which is evidence of their active engagement in the conflict, Koizumi said.